Hello, my wonderful and amiable listeners. Welcome to another interesting news. Indigenous people of Biafra has reinforced its accusation, its accusation on Commissioner of Homeland Security in Anambra State, Mr. Chika Odili Anara, of being responsible for the insecurity in the state. The group had a week ago made the same allegation, saying that the commissioner runs a group of armed men who they are accused of perpetuating insecurity. Anara had, however, denied the allegation, saying that the group was being sponsored to tarnish his image. In the latest press statement by the Indian people of Biafra, which was signed by the spokesperson of the group, Mr. Imar Pawafu. The group called for the arrest of the commissioner. The group listed some Anambra communities in Oka North local government areas as the area where Anara Abo Amen and have been terrorizing the indigents. The atrocities happening in these communities, Aqua North, were masterminded by Anambra Homeland Security Commissioner, Chikaudili Anara, Iki Igbakiba. Anambra State Government must investigate its Homeland Security Commissioner, Chikaudili Anara's relationship with some criminals operating at the above named communities and Ogbaru. We maintain that Chika Odila Nara, also known as, Agba, as Chika Iba Kiba, is sponsoring these criminals operating in these communities, which he should be questioning about what is happening in Isiodo, Uguaboshi, Achala, and those who are operating near his sister's house. Commissioner Anara must explain why his security outfit refused to chase those criminals away? Is it because they are partner in crimes? The Commissioner Anara must explain why his security, ref, uh, his security outfit has refused to chase these criminals away. In a previous reply to the indigenous people of Biara accusation, Anara has said Powerful has been in contact with him trying to extort him over a publication he said he intends to release. He has been he has been out to blackmail me and has been calling me since then. Even and I told him I expressly and I will never part I will never part with a couple to him. We recall that the Anambra State Commander for Homeland Security, Chekha Odilia Naira, has dismissed the dismissed the allegation against him by the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP, that he is using security apparatuses to first security in the state as false, baseless, and unfounded. The pro Biafra group, indigenous people of Biafra, a true spokesman, Emma Powerful, accused the commissioner of recruiting armed criminals who are alleged being used to intimidate, silence, and kill anyone who questioned his rascality and also using the criminal gang to impersonate the indigenous people of Biafra and the Eastern Security Network, ESN. The allegation by the indigenous people of Biafra group partly read IPOP intelligence units gathered that Mr. Chikodili Anara, also known as Ibakiba, who is coincidentally the Commissioner of Homeland Security in Anambra State, is the man responsible for the insecurity in the state. This man was the former security advisor to the previous governor of Anambra State. He recruited armed criminals who are being used to intimidate, silence, and kill anyone who questions his rascality. But reacting to these claims, in the statements made available to journalists in Oka Anara, Anara described the allegation as baseless, unfounded, and total lies.
saying that the indigenous people of Biafra high pop spokesman expressing was only blackmailing him after several attempts to extort money from him failed. The commissioner also identified two of individuals from Isia Notcha community names withheld as those sponsoring him are powerful against him. After he petitioned them over murder charge for which they were arrested and detained before they allegedly bribed their way out and fled into self exile. He said, in 2022, Ima Powerful called me and told me he had a story against me. He demanded that I pay him money to drop the publication. He later called again and told me to the same story which I ignored. He has been out to blackmail me and has been calling me since then. And I have told him especially that I will never part with a cobble. Today he has got, gotten his friends and two brothers who are involved in a murder case here in Ichia Notcha, Aqua North local government area, and they are sponsoring him to write against against me. I am not surprised about this right up. The truth is that Ima Powerful, whoever he is, is doing a paid job. I have severally invited him, if he is genuine, to come for a meeting. If he thinks it can help solve the problem of insecurity we are facing in the state. And I need to inform Ima Powerful that the Anambra Vigilante Group has existed for many years, even before I came into office, and I was not created because of the indigenous people of Biafra IPOP, which is a new and recent creation. He therefore called on Ima Powerful to make himself visible for a proper dialogue on how to end insecurity in the entire southeast region. The indigenous people of Biafra, where their spokesperson Ima Powerful, has accused Chief Onara of being a part of the people responsible for insecurity and killings in the southeast region. They said Onara must explain why his security outfits refuse to chase out criminals. And is it because they are partner in crimes with those criminals? The indigenous people of Biafra accusation went. That will be all for now. Please don't forget to click on the like and subscribe button. And let us know your t opinion and your thoughts via the comment section below. And I will see you on the next news. Bye for now.